what's up baby hey y'all welcome back to the channel okay welcome back to another freaking video man hey we're at the cleaning station at at my truck okay my tailgate got cash with us man he's watching us he's interested in what we're doing uh y'all we caught some freaking crappie y'all look how big this dude is about the size of, still alive how i caught you about an hour ago uh compared to this little one that we're just now for real getting cut up uh i got one filet right here right here i got it, it looks like crap because this crappie's really skinny but a storm looks like it's coming it's really windy out uh i'm gonna just go ahead and finish what I'm doing right here. Show y'all all the fillets when I'm done. If you like what you're seeing so far, man, subscribe. We always have fun over here. Make sure y'all do like the video, man, because this is gonna be a good one. Anyway, guys, here's some pictures of the fish, well, of these two crappie that I caught. Yeah, so we got the we got the jokers right here, man. So I'm gonna finish up cleaning them. I hope y'all enjoy this video, man. Let's get into it. Hey, yo, what's up, guys? It is Taylor freaking Campbell, y'all. It's gonna feel great when I walk outside. I'll piss off the porch with a deer on my sides with a new shotgun and a four wheel drive. I guess you could say country boys can survive. Now that I'm knee deep in the creek with mud between my daggum feet, I know now without her, I'm doing better. Now, here's my little station. If you don't know how to, yeah, this is my hand. Okay, my hands are pretty big. All right. And I, I wear a size 11. That was a pretty big fish. This is how you would uh, fillet a crappie. So you would get your knife, all right? You'd get your knife, go behind the little fin right here, the gill plate. You would come across and then cut down, just like that. And then you would work your way at the top, work your way around, bam, make a big hole, kind of like work your way throughout and stuff like that, you know? It is okay if you do get a little pins in there with little fish bones, uh, just pick them out. Uh, you won't get a lot if you know what you're doing okay so just be careful if you need to look up a picture of a fish and how the anatomy is that that works great too all right guys we did the first fish the little one that's him right there kind of decent small fillets but you know enough to you know eat somebody for you know for me to eat uh this one the big poppy big mama right here dude look at that bro if y'all knew bro that filet, that filet is, oh, that one's gonna be good. All right, let's get back to work. All right, we can walk over here, but we got the filets, man. Let's put them in a little sandwich bag and uh, put them in the freezer, man. Cause just in the next few minutes, you'll be seeing me in the kitchen with these bad boys. What? Hey, we got another freaking catch, clean, and cook, baby. Come on. Woo! Hey y'all, what we got on the menu is crappie, okay? Some fish fillets. Uh, this recipe that I'm about to use, you can use it on trout, bass, uh, redfish, anywhere where you're at, you can use this recipe, okay? So all we're gonna do is blacken them. All we got right here is my fillets. I do like to keep the skin on there. It's good, uh, especially when you get it all seasoned up and good. But we got our fillets down on the plate. We're gonna season them. We're gonna put them on the skillet, blacken them. It's gonna be so good, man. Right, guys, so what we got right here, we got our oven top on 400 degrees, okay? About 350, 400 is what you're looking for, okay? You want that butter? Oh, shit. Well, dang it. Come over here. Come over here. We're gonna season our fillets. You don't need a whole lot just because we're gonna be blacking them things, baby. We don't want them too blackened, but we do want them really freaking good, man. Now, flip them over. Now what you're gonna do is put your seasonings on both sides, man. That's what you're gonna do. Put your seasonings on both sides. You can use whatever you want, man. We're, today we got the Everglades seasoning and the complete seasoning with salt and pepper. So we're gonna get some pepper, douse these things up just like that, okay? Just like that. We're gonna have these stuff. Now, you just want a little salt on these fish, man. You just want a little salt on these fish. You don't want too much. Once these get done seasoned, okay? We're going to throw them up on the skillet, baby. All right, guys. Come over here. We got our butter. We're about to put our fillets on there. We're going to start off with the smaller ones. Uh, we're going to start off with the bigger ones just because they take a little bit longer. And they do fill up, literally, the whole pan. All right, guys. We got our seasonings up in there. Now, if you want to add more as you go, that is perfectly fine. Just how I'm doing right here. Let these sit for a minute. 
flip them. You're gonna be good, baby. All right, y'all. So literally, these fish are about to fall apart picking them up. That means they're done. So the thicker ones right here. So they did take a little bit longer to cook, but y'all, check that out. Oh, man. I wish you like this. Let's take it off. Wanted that blackened, kind of blackened to it, but we did get a little butter on it, but we got it. So y'all, these fillets, we're gonna eat regular. These small ones that we have on this little, on the cookie sheet, we're gonna uh, put them on a sandwich because it's, you know, small enough. We're gonna put both of them on one sandwich. We're gonna try both of them, see how it is. Y'all, look how these look. These look a hell of a lot, little better than the thicker ones, but we're really watching these smaller ones. It's gonna be a little eat, a little quicker to cook just because they're a little small, skinny fillets. All right, guys. So the last, almost the final step into uh, eating your crappy sandwich. Okay, your black and crappy sandwich. You gonna, you gotta get your butter, man, and you gotta get your bread. You got. That's your first thing. Why did I say butter? You already have the butter. You gotta get the bread, man. If you ain't got the bread, then you can't make the sandwich. We're just gonna wait a couple minutes so it can reheat. I totally forgot about the bread, so I like turned off the turned off the eye. I took the skillet out and cleaned it. I was gonna clean it anyway, just so I could put my bread on there. But uh, we're gonna let it heat up just for one second. Quick segment, bam! Oh, sh dude, it's not big enough. We're gonna make them fit. Okay, we're we made them fit. The skillet's too small. Should have thought about that, but we're going to make do. We're going to make do with it. Just like that. We're going to make do with it. Uh, you're probably wondering, Taylor, why are we seeing two catch cleaning cooks? Were you wearing the same clothes? It's the same day, man. Okay. It's the same day. Like I've said before, I'm actually in the middle of recording like two, three different videos in one day. So, yeah. Freaking. Taylor, done! Oop! All right, y'all, look at that, baby. We do got the fresh look at crappie right there. Now, like I said, we got the bread, okay? I'm gonna be putting little fillets on it. Just like this, the little fillets, all right, boo? Just like that. Okay, and then let's uh, close that her up right there. Guys, we're gonna set the sandwich to a side. I really wanna try this. I really wanna get my mouth up into it. So we got a little piece, my mouth's watering, man, of little filet of crappy. All right. It's pretty, it's pretty damn good fish, man. Let's try it with the sandwich, or let's try the Um, That was with the skin, too. Yeah, man, if you have some chips, some mayonnaise, some more salt and pepper, some lettuce, tomato, this sandwich would be busting. You wanna try it, bro? All right, bud, try it. Got the fish right there, let's see, let's see. What you think? Really good. Really good, hell yeah. I really did. good. Let it sit out for like a whole minute five minutes just because we're waiting on the bread and the other fish but other than that dude freaking good all right guys well that's all the time we had for today if y'all enjoyed this video y'all leave a thumbs up y'all know what to do hey if you are new subscribe check out the rest of the channel we have fun over here man we're gonna be over here finishing this fish man birdie kick them out man noggin